Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, family. Welcome to the mental house with me, your illustrious host, Khadija. Okay, I don't know what kind of sick game uh, is happening right now because this matrix is getting sicker and sicker by the moment. I try to reach for the beauty because you have to make it um, and, and, uh, in these times. Okay. And there's also a song <laughs> that used to go, In times like these, we need an anchor. In times like these, oh. We need a savior, so be very sure, be very sure that your anchor holds and it grips the solid. The solid rock. That's an old song, y'all. My grandma used to sing it to me. Um, and it's times like these that I know I have to go in deep because I really have a problem. What's going on with uh, this uh, Gosar Republican? This 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 uh, representative Gosar and what he's doing to AOC and uh, um. You know the the just the animation, the thing that he's putting up that he keeps retweeting. In other words, AOC's murder, and uh, um, this is getting to be real messed up. I don't know. Just a few years ago, if people remember the the woman that got shot at the uh, one of the uh, uh, baseball games, or uh, or one of the uh, Republican women who got uh, shot as she was doing um, a speech somewhere. These people's lives are in danger every single day, whether you like them or not. It's like if you ever had a meaningful job and you just had to do it. You 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 know, there are some people that are gonna be fans and there's some people who aren't. But you got a job to do and you take an oath to do that job. Okay. Now the House voted 23 to 207 to censure Paul uh, Gosar of Arizona on Wednesday. Gosar posted an anime a video that depicted him killing uh, Representative Ocasio-Cortez. Um, and the main shows him attacking President Biden. AOC asked why colleagues wouldn't vote to denounce Gosar for the video. What's so hard about saying that this is wrong? Gosar62 retweeted the clip moments after, moments after the censure. Uh uh. The Republican earlier defended the video comparing himself to Hamilton. He said earlier that he wanted to reach a younger audience and quickly removed the video but did not apologize for it. House Minority Leader Kevin McCarthy, a joke, blasted the move to censor Gosar. Uh, McCarthy threatened to, uh, in the future, Democrats would need majority support to keep committee seats. Uh, Gosar lost his seats on government reform, national resource committees. He stood in the uh, well of the House with Freedom Caucus members as it was read. He is just the 24th House member in history to be censured. Uh, Majority Leader Steiny Hoyer called the video vile and said it may be criminal. It is criminal. Um, there is a facet in this world, uh, in this group, and in this political body to put white supremacy full-fledged right back on the front burner. Now, y'all don't see it that way. Some of y'all see it as just a uh, straight Dominic, uh, a Democrat, Republican, which I really could care less about the labels. The labels don't, uh, uh, it don't even um, phase me one bit because I know the Democrat and the Republican is just two wings on the same bird. What y'all can't lose sight of, though, yes, one of them fake like 
they love you and they'll give you a few trinkets. But one of them despise you and don't care if you got chains back on you or not. Okay? Operate like Derek Chauvin or operate like um, uh, 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 the brothers, the, the, the guy, uh, uh, the guys down there in Georgia that killed Am Amon Aubrey. See, you have a big fashion of people who are remnants and still believe like they used to that black people don't got no value. They have no purpose. And their hatred for us is so, um, it's just off the chain. There's really no words for it. That they would lose everything they have to make sure we don't have something. Which is so sick because y'all don't understand that we're enmeshed. So as black America goes, so as white America goes. Because you're so stupid. The founding fathers that enmeshed us all together. You think you can rape us, give us babies and do all that. And mix us all up with your milk. Have us involved with all this shit. And think you can still go back and tell us to sit in the corner. And we're going to put you back in chains. Pretty much mentally. It does not work that way. Either we're going to learn to live. In this uh, 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 country together. Or like Dr. King said again. I'm going to say it to him. I'm blue in the face. We're going to all perish. Because it ain't going to be no you get rid of me. And you're going to still be standing. It don't work like that. And the faster you see that. The better off you be. Just like you can't heal. What you can't face. And if the sooner you face that. And understand that the better off we can be as a nation, as a country, because everybody is still laughing at us. Because, see, all the countries dealt with their history, except us. We can't deal with it. And it's because we can't deal with it, we're going to keep having this crazy race type of uh, uh, shit that really makes no sense. Uh, for Paul, uh, uh, for this guy to be... Um, Go sorry to be allowed to do this, to uh, have people even defend him as if it's a, a Republican, uh, a Democratic thing. That's all stupid. That's a game. It's a game. Anytime you got people standing up in audience, in, I mean, in, in Congress, anywhere, any positions of authority, and they're all believing a lie. Some of them are, don't know no better. Some of and I can't hold them accountable for what they don't know or how far their intelligence level go. But a lot of y'all know the truth. And you're still backing up a lie. And you're allowing a lie to, to, to divide us as a country. You allowing the lie to um, make people pick sides. Oh, either you black or you white. Either you black or you white. Either, no. Either you for truth, justice, are you for oppression and murder? That's what it is. They don't go no way. It's not a black and white thing. Okay? It's not that. And until certain people deal with what's going to happen anyway, all you're doing is prolonging it. You are not going to be able to continue to do things like this and not be held accountable. The fact that Paul Gosar retweeted the offensive thing shows that uh, your consequences don't mean shit. Something has got to be done for these congressmen, these people like... Um, What's the other stupid, crazy lady name that runs around uh, hollering in people's windows and uh, uh, all this kind of, you know, they call it in-your-face politics? Some of us call it straight gutter dwelling with low lowlifes. The thing is, what side of the diaspora, I mean, what side of the coin are you going to represent? This man should be kicked out and there should be criminal charges against him. I used to represent the city of Milwaukee. 
in the job that I did. So there were certain things that I had to do to represent the city, no matter how I personally felt. And if that's just on a city level, if this guy is representing his state and he's in Congress and y'all can't do nothing about this, I mean, and this is acceptable, then anything goes. Anything goes. I could not on my job threaten another co-worker, threaten, make jokes about the means about how he should be murdered or she should be murdered. And expect to have my job. Where in America that you can work at that you can do this? We talking about some censorship? McCarthy needs to be gone as well. Some of these people are not doing the country of America any good. And guess what, y'all? Y'all don't like to hear about Farrakhan. Y'all hate his guts. But I can tell you what a leader looks like when a leader tell you that uh, the country going to be destroyed from within. Y'all worried about Al-Qaeda. You're worried about uh, terrorists. You're worried the only terrorists and people we need to be concerned with is the people that live in America. Because that's who's going to destroy it. And once we get it just weak enough and they get it just ripe enough. Then China, somebody else will come in and then take our asses over. That's all. Because this shit here is totally unacceptable. Totally unacceptable. This man needs to be gone. He's a 24th House member to, in history to be censored. He should be kicked out. Can't fix what we can't face. Just can't happen. I'm on the war path today, y'all, as you can see. I, I, I ain't taking no prisoners either. I'll see you in the next one.